All right, what's going on guys? So this is going to be system test eight. As you guys know, a few system tests ago, I did a Wheelock themed system, but I didn't really like how that was done, so I wanted to redo it. So uh, this is going to be another Wheelock themed system, except in my opinion, it's much better. For the pole stations, because I was able to fix them, so we have pole stations back up. We have my Firelight BG12L, and for the one out here, we have the Firelight BG12, the one with the, uh, the hex key here. For the alarm up here, we have my Wheelock AHS D01. Uh, I think it's like 1.5 Candela. You can only do continuous, so that's what's going to be set on. Right here, we have my Wheelock AS 24 MCW FW 110 Candela. 110 Candela, code 3 medium volume, I believe. Wheelock MT 24 IS VFW, code 3 high volume, fixed 75 Candela. Because I did actually connect the strobe this time. It's SCR 1575 Candela. Simplex. Uh, Simplex 2098-9806 indicator. We lock in my Z 24SR, I believe, code 3. For the alarm in here, no SCR because my Wheelock WMT 24FR is here. Fixed 117 Candela. And for the alarms in here, we have my Wheelock RSS Fixed 75 Candela and my Wheelock NH set on code 3 low volume. But that's not where the notification appliances end because... I guess you can say this is an expansion out here. Walk around right here on this wall. We have my Siemens AS75 CRWP uh, Code 3 high volume fixed 180 Candela. Now, I did have my WMT24 FR strobe out here back in August when I got it, but I took it down because I didn't have a box for it. So it was going to get water damage, so I took that down. But since it's a nice sunny day for once, I decided to mount that alarm up here. But uh, you probably won't see another alarm up here until uh, like summer because I don't have any other weatherproof alarms to mount and I don't want my alarms to get damaged. So anyways, we'll go ahead and activate the system. Now it is very loud, so I'm not gonna let it run too, too long, but I will show you the, show, show you the alarm out on that wall last. So make sure my system's on, on, hold up. All right, sorry about that, guys, but we go ahead and I'm just going to open this up. All right, it's unlocked, so three, two, one. There we go. Should have grabbed the controller with me, but it didn't. Oh well. Right here. Let's go ahead and activate this. I'm just gonna open this up right now. This is being a pain and it's not wanna open. Oh, that's why I'm an idiot. Helps when you actually unlock it with the unlock arrow. Whatever. Three, two, one. Lock that back up the proper way. Jeez, I'm an idiot. There we go. Much better. Um, so let me turn this off. There we go. Activate that. And we'll go out here. And I'll turn it on. Out here so you can hear this alarm. It was pretty loud. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I did take all the tape off it because it was comically quiet, even on high volume. So in three, two, one. that up. I don't know if you guys could see the candela. That's what I was trying to show because the sun's in the perfect position. So anyways guys that is system test eight. I think the next system will be a system sensor system. System sensor system. Say that three times fast. Um because I have a bunch of system sensor uh, system sensor alarms that I want to get up. Also I don't know if you guys knew but uh system sensor just discontinued their advanced series. Hang on I'm gonna reset this discontinued their advanced series alarms like the HR, HW, SCRs, uh, and they're actually going to be coming out with the new L series. Honestly, I don't really like the looks of them, but like the aesthetics, but seems like some cool alarms. I'll leave that link in the description below. But yeah, anyways guys, uh, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in my next video.